Among this week's perfect scores, the Bishop High School Gymnasium, the Little Caesars on the 10,000 block of SPID, Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory at La Palmera Mall. I can definitely be the taste tester because I've had like, I've had it from Maine. Oh, okay. Portland, Maine, lobster, oh. fresh. Hey, wait a minute. Isn't that? Yeah, that's neighborhood news reporter Aaron Holly checking out what's on the Mass Hole Lobster Truck menu. The Mass Hole Lobster Truck. Only been in business in Corpus Christi one month. Owned and operated by Justin and Tim Boone. Brothers, born and raised right here in Corpus Christi. Graduated from Miller High School and years later, we're looking for a business venture. We wanted to bring something different to the Coastal Bend. Uh, we love seafood, we love lobster, uh, and you just don't see that a lot down here. Even at some of the seafood restaurants, you won't see a lobster roll. Tell me what that is. Uh, this is the lobster grilled cheese, and then what we have here is the lobster BLT. Right, so the thousand dollar question, how can people be assured and comfortable and confident that it's fresh every day? From a lobster perspective, uh, everything that we have is, uh, you know, flown in from the uh, North Atlantic. And so uh, every day. We, we make sure that our lobster week over week is going to be uh, the highest quality possible. So congratulations to Mass Hole Lobster Truck for earning their first Perfect Score sticker. You can check them out on Facebook for their times of operation and locations. Congratulations also to the Stingers Coffee on South Staples, the Most Comida on Naples, Veterans Memorial High School on Cimarron, and the Whataburgers on Waldron and the 6200 block of Saratoga. This week's low score, Acapulco Mexican Restaurant and Bar on Weber, 12 violations including the cook didn't wash his hands after cracking eggs with his bare hands, and the cook was preparing tacos with his bare hands. They received a score of 80.